was threatened by a weird guy in a mask a few months ago, and a lot of people were asking me questions about it on streams and videos, and I basically couldn't talk about any of it until now. So after this mask guy made some vague threats about my YouTube shorts, I immediately took a break from posting shorts and got a lawyer. I was advised by my lawyer not to speak on anything, which is why I kind of just ignored all the comments and stuff. I was just gonna leave this all be, but it seems like the mask guy is back now and some really annoying stuff is happening behind the scenes. Unfortunately, I still can't say a lot, but trust me, if you dig deeper, you'll find out more. The key is in your heart. Creepy guy in a mask has been sending threats to me and other creators, and now he's even stealing our content and re-uploading it to his channel. And the worst part is, I see tons of people in the comments who think this guy is cool or something and are even helping him. Let me just be real with you guys for a second. This boss guy sucks. Threatening and stealing from other creators is not cool, which is why I got together with some of the affected creators to officially form a class action lawsuit. Bro, I hate the boss. Not only has he stolen my content and reacted to it twice, he's also just so cringe. There are a ton of creators involved and we've got an incredible lawyer. I can't tell you guys who it is yet, but I think you'll definitely agree when you see them that this boss guy is going down. Justice will be served. Which one would you rather? Gamer edition. Quit gaming forever. Or five random people die. People die every second. Someone just died while everybody was watching this short. What did YouTube pick? I think they're all just as selfish and heartless as me. YouTube is too gaming pilled to ever quit. You are right. Minecraft 2 or GTA 6? I would rather have GTA 6. You know, Minecraft's a one and it could just stay one forever. What did YouTube pick? I feel like Minecraft 2 is like what little kids whisper about on the playground. YouTube went with Minecraft. Too. You are wrong. I'll always play in 45 FPS or always have wet socks. Oh God, I can live with the low frame rate. The wet socks thing is like an instant vomit. Does YouTube agree with that? I think YouTube's gonna be down with the struggle on this one. They went with the FPS. They don't want the socks. Would you rather continue this pathetic resistance or face bosses, bro? Wait, what are you guys talking <laughs> about? Sick and cut. Speed running dog You're my friend. Subscribe.
The resistance is here. You guys found my secret messages. The masked man called the boss who has been constantly stealing my videos and threatening my channel is finally being brought to justice. The boss thought he could use my friends to trick me, but wait, what the? <laughs> <laughs> you thought you could escape us? <laughs> Speed wait, no, 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 no. Nothing means more to me than this 11-year-old world. Watching years of hard work be destroyed before my eyes is tearing me apart. For the first time ever, I have to leave. I don't know if I'll be back. Things have been rough. After my world was destroyed, I wasn't sure what to do. Since that world was basically my job, I had to find somewhere else to work, or at least figure out something else to make content about. The boss was three steps ahead of the resistance the whole time. I had big plans. We had coordinates. We had a plan of attack. But I underestimated his reach. We were betrayed over and over again. And as if destroying my world wasn't enough, now they've doxed me in real life too. There are people coming after me and I don't have much time. So unfortunately, I've had to make some drastic changes to my appearance. For now, plan B, the lawsuit, is our only hope. I'm going into hiding. If you don't see me again on this channel, now you know why. Okay, I know I said I'd be gone, but my editor is gonna upload some shorts we made that we never posted. Shh, Miko, shh. So I'm gonna use the shorts to leave you guys messages. A lot of you guys have been asking me about my world backup. Normally I have a ton of backups in my world, but they hacked into my cloud files, so the automatic backups that get uploaded to the cloud are gone. I also have an external USB drive full of all my backups for like the past 10 years. That's why they came to my house. They actually took the USB drive. It's gone. I think I know a way to get the USB drive back, but it's risky. I think it might be a trap because why else wouldn't they just destroy it? But even if it is a trap, I have to try to get my world back. I have no choice, so I guess we're just going to have to wait and see, but I'll keep you guys posted. Like a My worst fears have been realized. He took my legs. I know that I'm responsible for this. This is the price I pay for my sin. I've barricaded myself within these walls for now, but I am not safe here. Only I know how to fix this. Please, listen to reason. I am so sick of hiding. I refuse to let some bully ruin my life. From now on, no more codes and no more secrets. I'm getting my world back and taking this guy down. Getting my world back felt so good, but not as good as revenge. The boss messed with the wrong creator. Now, I will destroy him.